Oh, do we got a treat for you? Yes, we do. Guys, we've got one of the youngest closers, one of the most bad to the bone bad coaches. To the bone. He's known in from coast to the coast. Elliot group. We've got the young closer today. Now, we're going to battle test him, but we're also going to show you how to put charisma on command yep. on your word track. Yeah, so you can close anybody, anytime, anywhere, under any circumstance. Let's go. This one's going to be sick. Okay guys, so there's an important thing that you have to understand. We're gonna teach you in this video by the end of it, not only are you gonna know how to handle some of the, the most common word tracks so that way you can dominate them and crush and close every deal, but we're gonna teach you how to learn. One of my problems was is I just wasn't a good learner. At least yeah. I used to tell myself that yeah. until I started to learn. We taught this young kid, Jacob. He was freaking 19 with us. He couldn't really talk. He had a freaking story. He couldn't read. Of, but he now read. the kid has triumphed everything. A crazy story. Yeah. He's got one of the most fire podcast out the young closers here yeah we're gonna battle test him yeah and look listen anything that you're gonna get in your life your vast majority of your wealth will come from persuading influencing yes and the way that you speak so jacob had to learn these things he went back to his store and he set the record for money made started making 30 40 grand a month now he teaches people in the young closers program how to do it all with andy so so here we go we're gonna me, bring him up on stage and then yep. we're gonna show you a couple things now let me explain something to too also guys listen <laughs> When you when you watch Jacob today here, you're gonna understand. Jacob spent thousands of hours writing these word tracks down. Repetition is the mother of all skill. When I say I wasn't a great learner, it's actually because I just wasn't dedicating the time yeah. and the effort and the energy yeah, and, and the capital it, it and the changed. capital. Yeah. So I wasn't investing my time, energy, and capital into my into the resource, yeah, which was and, training. And you didn't have a coach. You know, there was a day when we didn't have a coach, and so we didn't know what to do. Any good coach in life is gonna push you to get a result that you didn't know you could get. That's what. Andy did for us. That's what he did for Jacob. So today we're going to put his skills on display. Okay. Oh. So listen to this guys. Check this out. Imagine this. There's a customer. You go on a test drive. You spend an hour with them, dude. You're freaking vibing. You're shaking. You get off the test drive and the customer just says something very simple, but I can promise you if you're behind this camera, I could probably hit you with it and you probably wouldn't want to know what to say or it probably wouldn't make a whole lot of sense. Let's not be amateurs. Let's make pro decisions. Okay. So Jacob, I'm going to hit you with a really common objection. It's super easy. I know that you can handle it. Jacob, I get out the test drive hit me with the trial case. hey guys what's going on it's Andy a lot of you leave comments tell me that you need help do me a favor I'm gonna tell you the best way to get a hold of me shoot me a text message right now 918-210-0254 918-210-0254 I'll help you with whatever you need I got your back for life let's get back to the video Ian yeah. hey listen man if I can get everything to 110% of your satisfaction will you take the car home uh, you know what, man? Hey, I just got to think about it. You did a great job hey, today. Hey, listen, of course you need to think about it. I haven't given you enough information not to think about it. What I'd like to do is take you inside, give you a quick five-minute proposal of all the facts, figures, and information, so that way when you do go home, sit at the kitchen table, maybe talk to it with the girl, you'd have all the information to think about. If I can do that for you, would that upset you in any way at all? Would it? Yep. No? Come on, man. Follow me inside. <laughs> hey, where are you taking Good. me, dog? He's taking me. He's taking me to my car. He's taking me to my car. Okay. All right, listen, guys, focus on this. We're going to show you how to take these and make them deadly. Jacob, I'm show you how to convert Jacob. these. Now, slow down. Slow down for a second. I'm going to hit you with the objection again, and I want you to just say it real slow real and just do it for slow. me again. Jacob, hey, thank you, but I got a couple more cars. I got, I got to think about it. I just got to think just, about I it. Just I got to think about it. Got to think. Of course, you need to think about it. I haven't given you enough information not to think about it. What I'd like to do is take you inside, give you a quick five-minute proposal of all the facts, figures, and information, so that way when you do go home, you truly have something to, to think, think about. about. Okay. If I can do that for you, would that upset you in any way at all? Now watch this, guys. I'm gonna show you something. Everybody write this down. Internalize, memorize, customize, okay? Don't forget that. I'm gonna handle that here in two seconds. Jacob, let's say I go round two and I'm like, hey, you know what? Uh, thanks, Jacob. No, 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 no. Hey, man, listen, there's two more cars I gotta go look at. Right. There's just two more and then I'll get back with you. Jacob, how would you handle that? Well, first off, the first thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna ask the question. I'm gonna be like, hey, listen, those other cars you're gonna go look at, are they something similar to what we just drove mm -hmm. or are they completely different? Similar. Okay, great. So I just want to have Good everybody question. on the video because if they say something completely different, yeah, you, you obviously didn't right. do your job right. Take them back to the lot yep. so you can go sell them so they don't have to go travel. Okay. But if they are something similar, I'd similar. You, hey, listen, I totally get it. Let's say we already went and looked at those other vehicles and my 2019 Nissan Altima, this beautiful one that we just got done test driving, the one that you were jacked up, all talking about, screaming about, the one that yeah. we were just having fun in was the last one that you went and looked at. What would be the deciding factor of which car that you went with? Would it be the car itself regardless of the deal or would it be the best deal that the dealership's willing to give you?
Mm. Which one would it be? It'd be the deal. Okay, great. So it's not a matter of if you buy, but when you buy. And when you buy is when the deal's right, right? Right. Great. So if I could save you a whole lot of time and money and effort in buying this vehicle, would that upset you in any way at all? No. No? Great. Come follow me inside. Boom. But Guys. let's say this. Yeah. This is called being battle tested. Let's say you do say it's the car. Mm -hmm. So hit me and say, say, you know what? It's the car. So you know what? If the car was $10,000 more than what you're willing to spend, would you still buy it? No. <laughs> no, of course not. So it'd be the best deal. Guys, right? so listen. So it's not a matter them. of if you buy, but when you buy. Listen, he funneled them. Now watch this. Slow down. Watch this. Listen, this is where this is where you go to pro. A lot of people take that word track and they try to customize. They go outside and it doesn't make sense to the customer. They go out there, they try to strike back and it doesn't make sense. Okay, so what Jacob had to do was he had to internalize the, the it, objection. Memorize it. And listen here, he had to internalize it. Then he had to memorize it. Then he had to customize it. Yep. Okay. So if I have a customer, I'm gonna show you my customization. I'm gonna put some charisma on it. I'm gonna put some swag on it. Even though my boy Jacob's got some charisma and swag. Evan, hit me with the objection. Hey, hey, hey Ian. Whatever thank, the objection is. Thank you so much, man. I got a couple more that I want to go take a look at. Yeah. You were my first stop. Hey, Evan. Hey, Evan. Number one, dude, you don't gotta apologize for anything, dude. Hey, yeah, you're my brother. Come here, real quick. Oh, hey, dude. You, man. Listen, this car right here, this one that you just drove. Remember yeah. that? We were driving down the road, dude. You're all jacked yep. up. You're all fired up, dude. Yeah. We parked it in your freaking in your driveway, and you're all freaking excited. Remember we got out and I took a picture of you off the lot and you sent it to your wife. You're like, ah, I love this car. Yep. Okay, dude, let's say it was the last one that you took a look at. Look, if you went and looked at all of the other ones and then you came back to this one and it was the last one, look, would it be the car itself regardless of the deal? Or would it be the great deal that the dealership's willing to give you that would like make you move forward? Like, would it be the car or would it be the deal? Which it, one do you think it would be? It would probably be the deal, I yeah. think, yeah. Let's say you think it's both, whether it's the deal or the car. Listen, I know that you wanna get the best deal and you wanna get the best car. Am I right? Right. That's what anybody wants, right? right. They also wanna know that they got the right person, that they're at the right dealership. Look, I already know that you know you and me are friends. I already know that you, you believe in me. Yeah. I believe in you, man, and I like your family. Thank I like you. everything that you guys stand for. You guys are great. So what I like to do is just give you a quick proposal, and then in the end, it's your decision. That way that you know where we stand, how it looks, and everything's cool. Hey, if I could do that for you, would that save you some time and money, and would you be upset with me in any way, in any way at all? No. Dude, come with me real quick. I'm gonna show you exactly what I got. So guys, what did he do there? He's advancing the sale forward. We're out on the lot. He's pushing the deal forward. He's funneling them down. Ian and Jacob got this boiling enthusiasm because they're playing chess with the customer. Yep. They're not playing checkers. So many people out there, they don't know their job better than everybody else. What I would suggest, is number one, know your job better than everybody else. Write down the common objections that you're getting every single day yeah. and then memorize something, and then, internalize yeah, it, and, and then, then be able to customize it. it. And then the, here's the final part of that, guys. If you get upset when you get hit with the objection, it's because you're an amateur. Listen, when you hit me or Jacob with an objection, I'm like, oh yeah, let's <laughs> pop it. You know, it's, it's a game, man. Listen, if you're not getting hit with objections four or five times, you're probably not asking enough questions that are motivating them to buy, and you're probably not taking them further enough. So if you want to make sales fun again, right, and you want to have a lot of fun with it, well, then, and I see a lot of people that don't have fun with sales. Right. It's just for the reason that you're an amateur and you don't know what to do. And listen, that's not to hurt your baby feelings. It's to tell you the truth of how you can get to where you want to go. How you get to where you want to go, how you make this sport, this is a sport to us, and it's fun, how you make this sport fun is you know what to say, you internalize, you memorize, you customize, you're never worried, you're never sweating, you're never chilling, they say an objection, so, and you're ready. If I was gonna give you a pro tip, I would say sit down and ask yourself how much time how much energy and how much capital are you investing into this? Jacob, how much time and energy have you invested into understanding these word tracks and the skill of sales? Make, tell me in a quick conversation what that looks like. I mean, it's at least an hour every single night. I'm going back, I'm studying all the word tracks that I'm trying to memorize, that I'm trying to learn. So then I got them tattooed to my heart because you can have them up here, but until you have them tattooed to your heart, when you get hit with that objection, you're gonna then start stumbling, forgetting the words. So I would say it's, it's thousands of hours of Boom. just going crazy, trying to memorize them, trying to make sure I've got them tattooed to my heart. Okay. And so here's one thing. Hey, you can reach out and text me right now. 480-780-2203. Jacob also has role play classes. We have an Elliott Training Academy where we teach you guys these things. We keep you guys accountable. You can role play with Jacob live. You can role play with me live. We can go through these things, but if you're just playing on the sidelines, you're never going to play the game. Listen, listen. Players don't sit on the sidelines. Players get paid. They're in the game. Yep. If you want to be in the game, get in the game with Jacob. Join our Academy, reach out, text me. 480-780-2203. He and I and Evan and Andy can coach you. Yeah, and lastly, just think about what you do in the dark is who you will be in the light. So if you aren't training like this behind the scenes, but then actually taking it out and executing it, putting yourself under pressure, actually saying what we just showed you, so then you can customize it once you get great, it's never gonna happen. So yep. let's 
Let's execute. Let's go. Let's go. Job, go. Man, nothing else pays. Let's baby. go. Closers, Woo! come on. Hey guys, I just want to tell you, you're the true one percenters. You made it till the end of the video. Do me a favor, share it with the friend that wants to go to another level. Make sure you like the video, comment below so I know who you are. Set your notifications and then subscribe to the channel. We got daily sales training videos dropping. I'll see you soon.